I have to be very candid with you that this uh, landscape for me was the first time I've done any uh, watercolor for months. So I was stilted and I didn't pull off my best uh, work here, but uh, I, I did I did like little bits and pieces of it. And that's what I'm going to suggest to all of you. Um, we have to kind of tiptoe into uh, being uh, behind a brush again on some paper. Uh, but uh, I did accomplish some things. I've got every color and every color. It's kind of a, a blue orange with purple and yellow green, um, which is fine. Uh, I've got the darks and lights. Uh, it was, I, I overworked it. I overworked it because I haven't been around a watercolor, uh, painting for months. So hopefully the next one will be a lot, uh, smoother and quicker. There were some problems with it and I don't know if you can see it, but I, uh, it was starting to look muddy. And so I put some, uh, pastel, soft pastel over some of the water and some of the ground around the water. Uh, I didn't like the way my little shed was uh, working out, so I used just a, a plain old Sharpie thin line uh, to just enhance a few of the lessons, uh, the lines in it. Um, you'll notice that I didn't make a line for every single board or every single creek in the roof. It's just a suggestion so that it could kind of give it some uh, textural interest at the center of interest. The sky, I really like the sky. It's got um, some of uh, your yellow family and the red and the blue on top of the gray underpainting that I did the other day. I don't mind that the top of this mountain got fuzzy because it was wet and wet. It kind of sets that little bit of hill into the distance. Um, there's a lot that works here, but there's an awful lot that doesn't work. Um, so I hope to see you all on Zoom in the morning, in Monday morning, uh, at, well, at noon, and, uh, hope to see some of your pieces. Uh, this was just the first step of a thousand miles here for me. Uh, next week we are doing still lives and I've already started uh, looking at how I'm going to set that up for you. It's probably going to be wine bottles and a glass or something like that. But that will be the next project. Uh, look forward to seeing you then.